Welcome back, everybody, to another Oz on Gaming Dragonfire Real Raw Authentic Reactions for the real reacts as possible, very limited editing to keep everything real and flowing as naturally as possible. Tonight, we're back with a brand new reaction, a, another request from a friend of mine. Uh, we're going to be jumping into NF's thinking. Um, there's no music video for this, so it'll just be the audio. Um, full disclosure, as of every NF reaction I do, um, because I do know there's a lot of people that like to welcome people on the NF journey, um, which they're more than welcome to come and hang out here as well. But I do know a lot of them probably just like brand new reactions that have never experienced it before. Um, so I have no issues with that either way. Um, full disclosure, while I have heard the song, um, It's been a minute, and this is one of the ones I'm less familiar with. Um, I have listened to it maybe twice. Uh, it is not my go-to jam. Uh, from what I remember, it was a very good song, however. Um, but it has been a while um, since I have listened to it. The, fun, the, the thing I do find funny uh, pulling this up is, since, it, like I say, it's only the audio, the description reads, music video by NF performing thinking. It's literally just the audio at the cover art um, for thinking. So yeah, <laughs> it was just a thing that humored me. Um, but I will not waste uh, any more of your valuable time. Oh, also, before I jump into this, full disclosure, I am dizzier than usual. Uh, wasn't even going to do a reaction, but I wanted to get, get back on it and give you guys something. Um, so that is what we are going to do. So if I'm a little less together than usual, I uh, just wanted you to know why. For anybody that's new, since this is NF on the channel, which could attract a whole different uh, range of viewers, uh, the way I will run this is we will just watch or listen to the whole thing through. Um, I might make some points while it's playing um i will not pause or anything like that unless there is something i want to talk about before um i forget because i have a bad memory um otherwise we will do a recap after the song so um but our first listen through unless it gets blocked we like the kind of vibe um and speak as necessary um as i deem it uh i'll jump long enough though Let's flip it over to the other side and check out NF Thinking. Official audio. Let's do it. All right, guys. Welcome in. NF Thinking. Let's get it. You ready? And see, it's already a vibe as soon as it starts. Yeah. Growing up. Yeah. Know a lot, but I don't know enough. What you doing here? Thanks. Why you even showing up? Yeah. Showing up for trying to show me love. Why you look confused like you don't really know what's up? Yeah. Why you always trying to judge? I know who you are. Yeah. Why you trying to try to front? Yeah. I am not the man I was. Look, hey, made me a promise. I just hope you keep it. I don't like to get involved with things I don't believe in. I don't like to hang with people I don't trust to speak with. If you tell me that you mean it, then I hope you mean it. Yeah. I feel like I don't deserve you when I hurt your feelings. I'm vulnerable. You got the keys to open all my secrets. You've always been there when I'm low to help pick up the pieces. I know I act like I don't need it yet, but lately I've been thinking. Mm, yeah. Love those effects. Lately I've been thinking. Such a different style for him, too. I have been thinking. Nice singing. Yeah, Instrumental just thinking. breathing, sinking you in further. Yeah. I wish that I was optimistic. Me too. I wish that I could trust my intuition. To most negative thinking makes you a pessimist, but to me, negative thinking means I'm just realistic. I saw a feeling that a twisted view claimed that I don't care what people think, but is that really true? <laughs> Those are the type of questions that I struggle with. That's the type of thing that keep me up at night. Wondering, yeah. I wonder if the pressure I've been under is too much on my shoulders. Who gon' care when this all fades? I turn gray and get older. Yeah, that's the type of thing that I don't want to answer. But just because I don't want to do it don't mean I don't have to. See, these are lessons Facts. that you learn in life. And we only get one of them, hope I'm learning right. I know that everything comes with a price. Yeah. 
Yeah, everything comes with a price. Y'all got yeah. no clue what I've sacrificed. Mm. So lately, I've been thinking. That part of heads, man. You don't have no idea what I've sacrificed. Lately, I've been thinking. Mm. This instrumental, he lets this instrumental breathe so much. I have been thinking. Yeah, I have been thinking. the drums on this track too all right guys that was nf's thinking official audio let's flip it over to the other side and we will do our recap on this track hope to see you there all right guys that was nf thinking um if i haven't listened to the song in a while i do like it a lot more <laughs> than i remembered um might be just one of those things. I'm sure uh, we all have those things uh, where, you know, a huge on a song at a certain time, and then you go back to listen to it, um, and uh, you'd like it more. Um, it was always a good song. It's always a good song. Um, love the instrumental and the effects, uh, the reverb, um, and all the good stuff uh, that they did with the uh, instrumental his singing's always great. Um, flow was very different for him. Um, you never know what to expect with the guy, right? He 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 uh, toys around with a lot of uh, experimentation in music, which a lot of people are scared to do, uh, but he does do it. Um, as far as the song, you could easily say, obviously, you know, it's about a relationship of somebody, um, you know, um, and that's valid. It is valid. Um, for me, he was once again, uh, for me, just for me, um, personifying, uh, his, his dark side, you know, his demons. Uh, he personifies uh, emotions a lot through his uh, music, um, which could be very, you know, um, <laughs> confusing for our first time listeners to uh, end up when they just jump in or you're just like, who's he talking about? What, what What's happening? I'm confused because unless you really start getting into the NF experience, um, you don't really know what he's doing because he he personifies, which is, you know, to make it um, a living, breathing thing, which makes it obviously more immersive for listeners. Um, you know, he, he does a very good job doing that and painting pictures um, in very uh, big detail. And for me, that is what he was doing again um, in this song. Um, you know, and he's, the song at its core seemed to be, um, a song of deep self-reflection, um, you know, um, and how much he needed that other side of him. Um, and, you know, throughout his journey, he, he, he does talk about that even in his, his, uh, later songs, you know, uh, one of his last songs from his last album, Hope, was, uh, running where he was talking about leaving that part behind loves you know he loves it to death because it made him who he is um you know um but it's also weighing weighing down um you know so um trying to put all my thoughts here um, and my brain is scattered right now. It is literally going all over the place. Um, I'm trying to think. 
There was one lyric. Uh, that I... What was it? Oh, I know everything that comes with a price. Um, but you don't know the sacrifices I've made. Right? Um, which is obviously... Um, a thing that uh, everybody can relate to. You know, nobody makes it anywhere in life or does anything without a sacrifice. Yeah, it, it doesn't happen. You know, it's like the old thing with magic, right? You can't have magic out of nothing. Something has to give for that magic or a spell. You know, if you're into the fantasy stuff, um, whether you believe in magic, you don't believe in magic. Uh, that's not what this is about. I'm saying in general, you can't take something you know, and get something, right? So you can't get nothing. You can't get something for nothing. Um, there's always got to be that, that give or take for him, you know, to get to where he got, right? He had to sacrifice quite a lot to publicly put on display um, that, you know, he has went to war. In a lot of ways, uh, not just with mental health, but um, the industry, you know, because he could have easily probably been a, a more successful rapper. It depends on your definition of success. Um, if your success is money and fame, he could have been mad if he didn't rap about things uh, that he has chosen to rap about, which is his real life things he's 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 going through. Um, right. Uh, it would have been easier to just kind of fit the mold, you know, so it is a sacrifice to staying true to yourself and staying true to your beliefs on what you believe that you're doing um, instead of just going um, for that as well. He, you know, he sacrificed being away from his family, um, you know, criticism of people uh towards his music as many people throughout the years um crucify him of uh many different things uh being emotional um being a crybaby whining um only making sad music um or rolling stone said a one note depression ride. Um, trying to think of everything. Then on the other side, too, you know, because I'm not going to be getting into anything religion wise here, but, you know, he, at, for a while, you know, he was told he was a um, Christian rapper, right? Um, and, you know, he had to go out of his way to kind of get out of that space because that's not what he's trying to do. You know, he is Christian who raps. There's the difference between that. Um, you know, so he's had to do that. And, you know, he went out of his way to really tell people. I mean, even in uh, his song therapy session, right, he had a, he had a line in there that um, his music isn't just for people uh, who sit in pews. And pray at churches right um to me you know that was a lot of shots fired at kind of um people whether they're the religious people or people on the outside saying oh he's a christian he's a christian or you're a christian you're a christian you, you can't be making secular music stuff right um you know he he's made music for everybody doesn't matter what you believe in for him um if you're going through it he is Make music, so he had to sacrifice, you know, a lot of scrutiny on all, all sides of things. Um, you know, his journey is full with it, but I think more than anything, you know, he had to sacrifice putting himself out there. You know, and at the core of this song is about self reflection, you know, thinking, um, and yeah, yeah. Uh, he, he had that line. I don't remember what it was in the song. It was something, something, something. Um, but we all have to do it. I don't remember it word for word. Um, you know, basically understanding yourself and dealing with the situation. You don't want to do it, but there's going to come a time where you're going to kind of just have to do it. Um, you know, and, you know, talking about being negative thinking, 
Um, and you know, and if when you strip it down, you know the the uh, optimism, the the pessimistic, pessimistic stuff, and the people that ride the term um, realistic, um, scientifically and technically, there is only two: optimistic and pessimist. There is no realistic. Um, there are people that hide kind of behind that. Um, you know, because if you convince yourself of that, just because it is, oh, you're seeing it. And if it is for a long period of time, your brain's programmed to believe that. So you're being really realistic to yourself that, yep, yeah, this shit is bad. It's going to continue to be bad. It's just, it's just, it's just, it is still, um, pessimistic you know but what you're seeing that from the outside when you're looking at it from the inside to them it's realistic help in the same way um i try not to be um you know uh i try to be um as positive person as i can i am not a person though that uh for dreamers and sunshines <laughs> you know i i it, my streams you know i i preach good uh, good times and chill vibes all the time and this good vibes, but I never blow smoke up, up people's butts about stuff. Um, you know, I just do the best I can. It's all we all can do. As long as you're really doing your best, um, you know, that, 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 that's what's most important to me. Um, so that's my kind of way I cope with my, my issues. Cause I, I have, for those that don't know, manic depression, um, I am schizoaffective disorder. Um, I have a lot of, uh, not good thoughts about myself, right? I am nowhere near as bad as I used to be, but I am still there. I am still there. Um, so I have a lot of pessimistic thoughts. Um, I tried to be optimistic and say there's still hope. I don't know where it's at, <laughs> but it's there somewhere. Um, and that kind of is what continues to march me forward. Um, but self-reflection and thinking is a double-edged sword, right? It's crucial in growth and and healing, um, but it can also be detrimental uh, when you start overthinking, you know? So it's damned if you do, damned if you don't. Um, but it is still, as he said, a very important thing that at some point you're going to have to do. Um, so yeah, I mean, he even talked about the pessimist, about optimism, and um, you know, the him that's realistic. He even said it's kind of twisted, Aiden. You know, he he he's one of those people that has so much self awareness that he knows what it is. Um, that that's not a good line of thinking, but it is. You know, at this point in time in his life where he was at. Uh, so yeah. Um, if you're thinking that too, nothing but good vibes to you, uh, and hopefully, you know, you can continue to heal. Um, However long it takes, you know, it's a, it's not a sprint, it's a marathon, so take your time. There is no uh, right way to heal. There is no time scale for the healing. Um, if you're here tomorrow, the next day, the next day, it's progress. You just got to keep it going. Um, and, and that's all we can really do is just try our hardest, you know. But you got to make sure you are trying your hardest, not just making up something in your head like... Uh, <sighs> trying my hardest. Think about it first. You now, are you really trying your hardest? If you are, yeah, you know, then that's great. That's all you can do. Um, you know, I know I am. You know, but I know when not to push myself beyond the breaking point because I know where I can go. You know, like I also have uh, severe anxiety, generalized anxiety, and social anxiety, so I can't really do. The socializing thing, uh, you know, I can't force myself to do it because it's not good. Um, it's not good. So I do the best I can. You know, I I stream, I I make videos, I talk to people the best I can. Um, within my controlled environment, and hopeful that maybe someday I will, uh, be a little more open to doing stuff like that. But you know, it's hard. You have a life of anxiety and depression, right? 
But that's all we can do is try. Um, remember, if you made it this far, you're awesome. Just keep it going. Um, thank you for watching this reaction. It just was a little bit longer than I intended it to be. I do apologize, I'm, and I'm sure many are not going to stick through this entire thing. They hear me rambling like a rambling man. Uh, I do apologize for it. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed at least three minutes of the reaction, which is during the actual song. Um, and yeah. I uh, appreciate everybody. Uh, thank you for the request. Again, um, I will be back as soon as I am physically and mentally able with a, another reaction of, well, you never know, uh, on the channel. So, hope to see you on the next reaction. Have a great rest of the morning, afternoon, or evening, wherever you may be, uh, when a view in this reaction. I appreciate all the support since I began the reactions until this latest reaction. Um, it means the world to me more than you'll ever know. Uh, so thank you. And, uh, remember, I will always leave light on for anybody that needs it. As dark as your days may be, there is still a glimmer of light. You got this. Appreciate you. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.